The ministry has embarked on the establishment of intensive care unit at various hospitals around the country. And for Rundu Internet Intermediate Hospital, construction have started on the 7th of February this year to construct a 12-bed facility for the Rundo Intermediate Hospital of ICU. The project is anticipated to be completed by the 7th of October 2024, and the total contract value for the project is 9,829,000 Namibia dollars, and this includes is inclusive of the renal of the dialysis unit. The government spends upward 100 million Namibia dollar every financial year on renal dialysis care by referring state patients to various private facilities. The ministry has thus embarked upon the creation of dialysis unit with a capacity of eight chairs within the Rundu Intermediate Hospital. Psychiatric and hospital waste related services in Rundu are also said to improve, according to Dr. Shangula. The ministry has taken note of the lack of appropriate facility for psychiatric inpatients and outpatient services. A feasibility study to this effect has been commissioned to aid in the design and construction of psychiatric units in all hospitals. The ministry continues to maintain health infrastructure. The incinerator at Rundo Intermediate Hospital has not been functioning optimally. As an emergency, a contractor has been appointed to refurbish the incinerator. But the ministry is working on a long-term solution for the procurement of the new incinerator, as well as the new position of the incinerator. The minister called for improved health awareness among communities starting at home. Governments and other institutions must do more to deliver the services that, are, that our people need, wherever they are, without suffering financial hardship. This is achievable and doable through the efficient allocation and use of available resources and involvement of communities and affected individuals. This means that each one of us must take our health seriously because good health must start in our homes and in our communities. The World Health Day commemoration, which was held under the theme my Health, My Right started with a march in the CBD area and ended with various health screenings for the general public.